Hi guys, I'm Jojo Astro Barbie, Fairy of Love. How are you? Welcome to your weekly horoscope. Well, this week the sun is in this beautiful royal sign of Leo, so happy birthday to you. Leos, we love you. Get ready for quite a ride in August. Yes, this, uh, this week and the whole next two, three weeks will sort of be a life-changing experience for you for the better. This week the moon will travel in the signs of Capricorn, Aquarius, Pisces and Aries and it's eclipse season that's why I'm wearing my glasses so my friends you better fasten your seatbelt because we are getting ready for quite a ride which means it is better this week to really really go slow to keep things simple and try as much as possible to reschedule important events in love friendship career in, in finances, it's not too bad, depending if you really do it cautiously. For some people, they could really make lots of money. Some other people, they could lose. So it all depends on your chart. You can check with me if you are in doubt or you have some questions. By the end of the month, everything will be back pretty much to normal. But everybody's life will be have changed somehow. More clarity. You'll see these are the most powerful month of the year this year. So fasten your seat belt. Let's get ready to be the best we can be and learn all the lessons that we learn to learn in order to be the best we can be. So we start the week on Monday with a powerful full moon lunar eclipse in the sign of Aquarius. That's a big deal. That will lead to the biggest celestial show of the year that will occur on August 21st in the sign of Leo. So that's quite something and we're we're picking up that right now so there will be a lot of sensitivity there will be a little bit of craziness in the air but it's okay it's all for us it's like uh, the universe is like uh, working on the fields of the earth in order to turn all the earth around in order to prepare for a new landing of new experiences and a new beginning in our country and in the world this week's full moon eclipse makes a friendly alignment with wise Saturn and lucky Jupiter and although it is an eclipse that's good it's a very good time to complete projects to finally get the money that we want and also everything dealing with friendships politics humanitarian affairs house repair car car repair are definitely favored it's not a good time though for elective surgery you know, if you go to the hospital for operations or any kind of things that deal to a surgery, try to avoid it until the end of the month. It's also a time not to sign important contracts if possible. The most important is to keep our promises, to be generous, to lay low, to be humble, take care of our responsibilities, and truly have a love and peace attitude in everything we do and learn the lessons that the universe is talking to us right now. I'm telling you, it's extraordinary. We are having a conversation with the universe in this extraordinary month of August. So let me start with you, Leo. Happy birthday to you. Leo, I love you. I love you, my sweet Robbie. You are my sunshine. Happy birthday. Well, the lunar eclipse in your relationship sector brings an awareness about who you are and more clarity also about the people you love and care for in your life. You'll be able to make some very beautiful, wise decisions in these matters and also everything to do with cars, houses, land, real estate, also favored. And your sense of self is very strong this week. You're going to see, especially after Wednesday. And at work, co-workers, powers that be, appreciate your efforts and definitely rewards in that part of your life. Financially, you may be having to negotiate, but at the end of the day, you'll have the last word and you'll be able to be, get what you want for yourself and other people. In love, get ready for a lovely surprise that you did not expect. And on the weekend, celebrate your good fortune and realize how protected you are all in all and also get ready for feeling loved very very appreciated your magical color gold lucky numbers 8 and 25 
Virgo, the lunar eclipse in your work sector brings success with the public and also projects. You are able to see people and situations in a new light. You also more clear about what you want and what you don't want. It's a time to also expand very much your mind and in love, a good time to really express your needs, your feelings, and also realize the definition of reality in your life. What does it mean real? You'll deal with that this week. Most importantly, also keep your personal and your work life separate. On the weekend, tenderness awaits. Your magical color blue, like your numbers 9 and 45. Libra, the lunar eclipse in your creative sector brings you a higher mind, a sense of adventure, and also a desire to escape reality. Go ahead and do something to relax and to change your mind, yoga, classes, or a seminar, maybe a trip with a family, with friends, or specials, a very special someone. Philosophy, the occult, meditation, walking in nature all bring answers to you, and on the weekend, share your dreams. Your magical color turquoise like in numbers 1 and 10. Scorpio, the lunar eclipse in your home sector makes you assertive, smart, and also it gives you a chance to enhance and grow your reputation. In career, go slow. Read between the lines. Also, investigate and take care of bills. This is a good time to discover new ways of doing things and to create a new life that is more and more the way you want. Everything to do with travel, to get away somewhere, studies, and maybe even flirting a little bit is favored. On the weekend, definitely uh, love will come your way. You don't even have to. It's knock knock who's there, love knocking on your door. So answer. Your magical color red, like in numbers two and 11. Sagittarius, the lunar eclipse in your communication sector makes you more open-minded about yourself and also about other people. An attractive new proposal could come your way in the love department, but take your time. Try to also listen to what other people say. The other people's point of view is very important now. Don't try to be right, listen. And also try to be emotionally detached in everything you do at work, in your personal life, and in love, the question, are you really happy? How could you make your life really, really perfect? If you are happy, enjoy. If not, do something about it. Legal matters are favored, and on the weekend, spend time with yourself. And Pisces, Cancers, and Taurus definitely applaud you. Your magical color is red, like in numbers 3 and 12. Capricorn, the lunar eclipse in your financial sector makes you very generous, powerful, and also resourceful. Your passion can be really stirred up. Embrace all your new experiences with faith. Don't go fear and crazy. Put the brakes and just be full of faith. Your spiritual self this week will be very, very much enhanced. It will get a boost. In career, your patience and leadership really make a big, big difference in people's life. And on the weekend, the more you give, the more you will receive. A Cancer and a Scorpio show they care. Your magical color mauve, lucky numbers, 4 and 13. Aquarius, the lunar eclipse in your sign. You are the real star all week long. Make you quite lucky, protected in love and career and finances. Your relationship deepens. You could make some choices. Some of them, of, the, of your relationship, they will have to go by the window and some new relationship may be coming in slowly. Some decisions is made this week. I love it. Love yourself, protect yourself. And remember, if the relationship is not balanced between receiving and giving, it's not good for you. Also, in career, some project could get a good light and good, a, good, a green light. A good time also to think differently, out of the box, and to show your uniqueness. On the weekend, romance, definitely awaits. So your magical color violet like numbers 5 and 41. Pisces, the lunar eclipse in your spiritual sector make you intuitive and super creative. This is a good time to really gather information, investigate and dig deep for answers. The focus is on the higher self, your spiritual values. Have faith. All is possible these days and everything is negotiable. And on the weekend, you really could have some psychic experiences, so be ready. Ooh. Your magical color purple, lucky numbers 7 and 14. 
Aries. The lunar eclipse in your social sector bring optimism, innovative ideas, and a lot of charm and sex appeal. And also, many, many answers to many, many questions you've had in the last few months, especially in love. An ideal time to really discover who you are, what you want, what are your needs. In love, it's all about live and let live. Don't push. Just keep a balance between giving and receiving. Be daring and take initiative in career because you're lucky there. And now the weekend, get ready for tenderness. Your magical color yellow, lucky numbers 4 and 13. Taurus. The lunar eclipse in your career sector bring you new opportunities in social life and finances. You're in the learning curve in personal and career life and it allows you to surpass yourself. Don't you think you're a winner these days? Yes, you are. Excellent time also to get together with mind, like-minded friends and family and have some very good ideas. Maybe to do something about your health also, lose weight, stuff like that. This whole month is fabulous for that. And whatever you do, listen to your intuition, okay? Because now you have the power to really take some decisions that people don't have the power. You are the one in tune now. So take advantage. On the weekend, you truly enjoy your home and your family. And you're proud of your accomplishments, what you should be. Your magical color turquoise, lucky numbers 5 and 32. Gemini, the lunar eclipse in your karmic sector bring you like answers to so many questions. You also may be rethinking about all of your life and what is important, what counts for you. And is it all of facts? What is important, facts or intuition, knowledge or wisdom? And this week, trust me, intuition, wisdom will be the answer. In career, take a break if you can, reevaluate your positions, plan your strategies, but take, take some time off. You need to, to catch your breath. The secret for your success this week is to be true to yourself and to really pay attention to the rules and take the time to do things right. On the weekend, you really have peace of mind and it feels great. Your magical color, yellow, lucky numbers, six and 33. Cancers, the lunar eclipse in your shared resources sector make you witty, wise, protected, and also you benefit from the generosity of others. Get ready to feel things deeply, of course with the eclipse, all that stuff in the full moon, whoa, it's going to be really, really deep. Except do not go fear. Go from fear to faith, because now you are on the miracle zone in finances and career, and especially in your health. So just welcome the healing. In career, listen to the ideas of others and also keep all the doors open. Okay, don't burn bridges. In love, go with the flow and pay attention to the needs of others. On the weekend, you receive what you have given and it's gonna be plenty. Your magical color red, like in number seven and 21, ta-da! And now here's your wizard affirmation of this crazy eclipse, wonderful, exciting, enlightening, beautiful full moon eclipse week. Loneliness, aloneness. Hmm, we wonder why did Prime Creator create that? Well, aloneness, loneliness is always a time where God, Prime Creator, or the universe, whichever you want to call it, need to have a very private conversation with you. It's true. So happy eclipse in Aquarius for everyone, and please make a wish especially about love and your personal life because I promise you the eclipse will grant it. I love you guys. Be good now. Enjoy the eclipse.